Kingdom family, my name is Candy Nicole with Arise, and today I've come with a word for you, which is actually a continuation of some of the things I was speaking about in last night's midnight listening party. If you are a part of that party, then some of this will resonate with you, and if not, I'm sure you'll be able to pick up on it. Last night, God was saying that he is about to bless his children tremendously, and one of the scriptures that he was basically giving me last night is this. Joshua 24, 13, it says, I gave you a land on which you had not labored and cities that you had not built and you dwell in them. You eat the fruit of the vineyards and olive orchards that you did not plant. Also last night, God gave me the word. He said, writing tailcoat. And I didn't understand what he meant last night by that, but he had me go back and look more into that, okay? Mind you, the scripture we just read in Joshua 24, okay? It says, riding someone's tailcoat is an idiotism. You know, you country girl trying. I'm trying, y'all. I'm reaching, okay? I'm gonna get there, all right? Uh, <laughs> that means to benefit from someone else's success, often without earning it. For example, they accused him of riding the coattails of the presidents. This term is a derogatory. And it implies that someone is dragged along with with a successful person instead of working hard for their own achievements. But God is saying not in the way he's about to do it. Okay. It is normally looked as as derogatory. But God is saying that he's about to put certain people in your life who's already up there. And you're going to be riding the tailcoat, meaning they're going to bring you up to where they are. Many of you, God has given you a dream that is so big that you do not understand how you are going to get there. Well, let me give you the answer to it. First of all, you're going to get there because of God and he's a big God. But second of all, he's already placed people in those high places who are going to favor you. So God is saying many of you are going to ride the tailcoats of these people, meaning that they already have the fame. They already have the money. They already have the resources that he is saying that you're going to need. And he is going to bring those people into your life so that he can move you where it is that he wants to move you. And right now the Holy Spirit is reminding me how he continues to show me that there was a group of people who were in the shadows, who were in the dark. And there's a spotlight in front. and He's taking those people and pushing them into the spotlight. God is bringing his people into places of influence. So for many of you that God is showing you this big dream and it makes absolutely no sense. It will be someone that's already in the spotlight who is going to take you along and push you into the spotlight. Favor is your portion this season. God has told me that favor is the new currency. So I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and I will speak with you soon.